So the L. Ron Hubbard Achievement Awards celebrate writers and illustrators of the future. And each year, the best writers and artists are honored at a Hollywood Gale in Los Angeles. And this year, one of the top winning artists is from right here in our area, from Carlisle. Cassandra Boland joins us now to tell us about this award. And uh, we appreciate you being here. I was looking at your website, your blog that you do, and your work is just amazing. It really is. Thank you. Yeah, of course. So congrats to you. And talk a little bit, if you will, about the contest and what it meant to you. Um, okay, well, the well, first of all, it was just amazing to get that call. I got the call in uh, December, and then there were press releases, and um, and it was a big deal for me because I've been living overseas for about seven years, trying mm -hmm. to start my career, and. Um, so after seven years of practicing, it's nice to get recognized. Be recognized, absolutely. You brought your award here with you today, yes, which is. is beautiful. So, <laughs> so you know, you did talk a little bit about how your travels inspired a lot of the work you do because it's mm -hmm. really about empowering women. Is that right? Right. Um, I've always been interested in gender dynamics and uh, um, feminism, but I guess as I've gotten older, I've mm -hmm. gotten more comfortable with that and actually started to um, brand my work that way and uh, it's exciting to be able to contribute something meaningful. Absolutely. So so what's next? You, um, I see you've got a book here in hand. So yes. what, what's next for you? Okay, so for me, um, well I'm still enjoying all the afterglow from, yeah. <laughs> from this, but I've got a personal project. Um, it's going to be called Reverse Mythology mm -hmm. and it's about, it's a gender switch in Greek mythology to just bring to light the way that we view women in fantasy. And, uh, yeah, so that's my next thing. And also, I'm doing uh, freelance work. You're also doing free And we're taking a look at some of your work here right now. Tell us about some of these pictures as, as they go through. I mean, they sure. all, you do have a very uh, unique style about your, your work. It's really nice. So tell us about what inspires you with some of these. Oh, um, everyday people inspire me. Mm -hmm. um, I use real models. And also, of course, the reality and the fantasy always feed off of each other. So um, I just like to heighten the good things about people and bring them to life in fantasy. Um, I also really love mythology, and so I just combine everything. <laughs> how, how does one get to this point? Because I always loved artwork in, in high school and things like that, but you, what is your background with art? Um, I've just been doing it ever since the beginning, which I think a lot of artists will probably tell you that. Okay. Um, and I never had to think about what I wanted to be. I got a BFA when I went to college in fine arts. And after that, I just do it in my spare time. So. Mm -hmm. I'm just drawing every day pretty much. Good stuff. And that's always been the way it has been. So. It, it is very good stuff. And this is, of course, the gala here that we were talking about a bit earlier. What's it like going to something like this where you're being among all of, all of the best of the best out there? Uh, that was pretty crazy. I've never done anything like that. Honestly, it felt like a movie star. And it was very L.A. Um, so it, it was pretty incredible. Um, and the uh, speech that I had to give was... Yeah a big confidence booster getting up on stage with all those people watching you so that Very was exciting good. yeah well I, I posted a picture of that speech on our, our website uh, or excuse me on my Facebook page and our Facebook page uh, it had to have been a quite uh, quite an event to go to so congrats again thank you uh, we have a book <laughs> signing so this is also something coming up that you have uh, can you tell us a little bit about this yeah I've got a book signing coming up at Midtown Scholar um, I also just finished one up at Camp Hill uh, but that's gonna be exciting because I get to talk to other families fans of sci-fi fantasy and if you want I can sign a book for you there so. you go we'll get on out and check it out and I did post a link to your blog as well so great thank you very cool stuff yes hey thanks for coming in this morning thanks good luck nice with your you. yeah of course of course <laughs> 752 we'll be right back <laughs>